DJ Payne one. Pain one. Me being able to get a passport or my choices to go to a different school, then go to Holy Cross or Trinity Catholic or Holy Cross and the people I met during the way. So it started as I'm a uh, Ferris Avenue kid, you know, born and raised 7J. And you know, when I'm playing basketball on the way at Don Bosco, my coach is here, Bill Walsh, who there was times where, like here, Bill Walsh. So Bill Walsh is the one that actually from couldn't play at CYP, a lot of little politics happened. He said, we got a kid right here in White Plains that, you know, could come play for Don Bosco. So he came up and sat in my living room, spoke to my mother and said, listen, we want to have Tory come. From there, you know, I came and played Don Bosco. We played about 65 games. I got a chance to meet the O'Leary's. My second family right here, the O'Leary's, Mary Ann O'Leary, Michael O'Leary, and, you know, this is part of like the, the process hey, that coming up from Ferris, you got Larry White. His name is Pumpkin for me. He's the one that actually told me that you could do anything in this world. You don't have to go to White Plains High. Don't go to White Plains High, which was the best decision of my life because I went to Trinity and met the beautiful people like Coach Fazari. Bill Walsh brought me up, with the O'Leary's. That's here today. So I really have to acknowledge my, um, you know, my sisters, my older sisters who would bring me around, Shana, Tashana, and Tammy. All right? I think I was there. You know, hemophilia. I want y'all to know what that is. That's a disease that can't clot, it's internally bleeding. So he couldn't play sports like me. And I even got a mixed up of a card in seventh grade that meant that I couldn't play sports because they switched Trayvon's, the doctor switched Trayvon's car with mine by accident. And I had to do testing, testing, testing to be able to say I don't have hemophilia. But with that, his perseverance and the type of kid, the type of heart he had, you know, I just want to tell him thank you. Yeah. So I just want to let you know that you know, this is like, you know, I know I'm going to, I just have to get this out because it's, it's serious. There's a lot, of, a lot of times that you're going to see the room like this, all these beautiful people from different races, different countries. We got, I want to shout out uh, uh, from Toronto, Amira, thank you. 
all my people from Trinity Catholic, Cassandra, we got, all, we got a team of people that really matter and they care. And it gets to my, the, the main thing, the why y'all here and how organized this is, is my uncle. My uncle Bill. Hey. Drop an inch. Drop an inch. I had to be here at 9 in the morning. If I was here at 9.02, he was on my, on, my, on my phone. Where are you at? And I just love you for that, man. It's a beautiful thing. And uh, I know that comes from my grandma, my grandma, his mother, Bessie McKee. And, um, you know, my mother started to be able to help kids along the way. is in her name, um, unexpectedly. It was a tough time for me. My mom, you know, passed away, but um, we strong, we strong. I'm gonna get, we gonna get through this. And it was tough because I'm all the way in Tunisia, Africa, and I get a phone call from Shana saying that mommy's not, you know, doing well. And it was just a spur of the moment thing, and it, it happened. But um, the love here, the love is here from everybody. I feel it. Thank you for coming out to this type of, you know, organization to celebrate me to get a citizenship, but also you know, my mother, and I know that she would love for us to just party, dance, and enjoy the nights, you know? So this is the way it is. And um, I just want to thank y'all. We're going to serve dinner, and let's turn this thing up. I appreciate that. Soldier, I'm in the building, it's going down. Money Sean, Hot 914 Radio. We in the building, once again, at the Sons of Italy in White Plains, representing my man Tori right here. Italian citizenship, he got a citizenship. Um, it's definitely going down, man, today. Nice event, you know, band, DJ, and uh, a lot of people came out to support Tori. It's all about Tori, it's all about Team Tori. Um, the compound is in the building. Of course, New York Home of Hip Hop is in the building. Um, you know, we in here celebrating my man Tory, yo. It's, it's all good. The Tory salute, man. We here for you, bro. You heard? Judge me, cause you see it from the same point of view. Cause I got issues. special special friend right he's, he's done things that no one else has ever done in my life for me with me you know what I'm saying you know genuine pure you know what I'm saying like definition of a friend is not even in the dictionary when it comes to Tory there's no definition you know what I'm saying so this guy right here no matter what we do I don't think we could ever do anything to really show how much we love him how much we care about him and what he does for the community, for his family, for his family and friends. So what we want to do is want to do a little something special for him right now. Where's he at? Dory, drum roll please. Dory. 
trips. We did one to Mexico and then we did another one to Toronto. So we did a lot of... Uh, uh, born and raised in Toronto. I love singing, always have since uh, I knew I could talk, which was like very young. Um, I sing R&B and I have a passion for it. So go ahead and follow me on Instagram, Spotify, Apple Music. Uh, yeah. So the first song that I'm going to be singing is called Casanova. I was in my room one day and um, I was in my fields. You know, you know those ones when you're in your feels? So uh, this song is just about, it's about love. It's about, it's, it's about love. It's about true love with someone. And uh, yeah, so let me know if you guys like it. It's an unreleased song, so I really want to get a taste of the crowd and see if you guys like it. All right, I'm ready. Soon I'm in the building of Cold War Soldier. I got a lovely, lovely lady all the way from Toronto that was throwing it down right here at Tory's event. Just let my listeners know who you are, where you come from, how long you've been singing, and, and why'd you come support Tory? So my name is Amira. Um, I'm from Toronto, born and raised. Um, I know Tori. Funny enough, we actually met one time downtown Toronto during Caravana weekend. We ended up talking, and he told me that he does events. So I was like, oh, so that's sick. Like, hit me up if you're ever doing an event. Um, so we actually stayed in contact, and he hit me up, which was so dope. It was so cool to be here. Um, what else did you ask me? Uh, how long you been singing? I've been singing since. Honestly, since I knew how to talk, when I was younger, I would do renditions of the Canadian National Anthem in, like, different, like, ways. Like, an opera way, a country way, Canadian, like, it would be weird. So, I always loved to sing, um, and I really decided to dig deep into this when I was in university. Um, yeah. So, are, are, you, are you a model, or you just sing? Um, she needs to be modeling right now. Sing is good, okay. but the modeling, yes. Um, I guess I could do both. No, but on a real note, I don't really model. I'm more of a singer. Um, definitely open to opportunities, hit a girl up. No, I'm just joking. But yeah, yeah, yeah. I love singing, though. That's my passion. I live, breathe. I'll die singing. Like, that's my thing. Yeah. All right, well, we, we thank you for coming out and supporting Team Tory. Go Tory to compound. Go Tory. And uh, give us a shout out all the way from Canada. Yo, shout out to Tori, shout out to Go Tori all the way from Canada. Congratulations, Tori, you a real one. Shaman, I'm in the building, you already know, the Cold War soldier, you heard? Tori, but tonight we are here with a uh, touch of Italian soul. I don't know if this brother's Italian, but we're going to find out. Right, right. Well, listen, I'm Rhythm. I'm Tori's right-hand man. 
So I'm the one that came up with the concept for a touch of Italian soul. Okay. Right? My man, my man, my close friend, Tori Thomas, he just received his uh, Italian citizenship. He's going back overseas to play ball for the season. So we did a celebration in honor of him, in honor of uh, him achieving this accomplishment as an African-American to actually get his documents for his Italian citizenship. Okay, that mm -hmm. sounds really good. And what part do you play in that? I mean, other than coming up with the concept. Are well, you going to be over there with him? Well, I have my passport, so I'm going to be traveling, definitely going to Europe. Like, the bigger plan is we're going to set up, like, we have businesses and things here. We're going to set up business and things in Europe as well. You know what I mean? So that's the real, the major thing to achieve, um, to be able to live over there and be able to do business over there so we can do import, export. There's a lot of opportunity Sounds making good. this move. So where are you originally from? I'm from White Plains, New York. Same place as Tori. We all from, from around the way. Okay, y'all yes. grew up together. Yes. Well, actually, Tori's much younger than I am. I grew up with his sisters. Oh. So they introduced me to him, and ever since then, it's been a decade now. I've been handling a lot of his business affairs and et cetera, et cetera. That sounds really good. I'm, yes. I'm, I'm glad to, to be here tonight. Yes, and I'm glad you you are here tonight as well. <laughs> yes, for sure. So what else would you like to, to do a shout out to anybody that's not here? Well, well, not even a shout out. I like to say whoever's not here, you missed a great event. Like that, like when you see the other footage of this event, you'll see the caliber of what we're trying to accomplish. You know what I'm saying? Like we have adults, we have uh, mid mid aged people, we have younger people, but it's just a good class and a good caliber of people that we, we have come out to our events. So, you know, if you missed it, please, you just missed it. Oh, well, I guess you gotta wait till next year. Absolutely. All right, so we're out, we're out. Good evening, everybody. Tonight we're here uh, celebrating Tori, a touch of Italian soul. Tori is the man of the hour tonight. I'm Debrina. They call me Miss D. I'm from Hot 914. <laughs> okay, so I have, I have the pleasure of interviewing Tori. Tori, can you have a few things to say to us? I want to say thank you for everybody to come. I just became a dual citizen. Um, I have my Italian citizenship and my American citizenship. So everybody came out to celebrate a great event and also about my mother too. A scholarship fund, Rosemary Thomas Scholarship Fund. We're just trying to help kids out and I'm just happy to be here. Very blessed. Yeah, I think it's a wonderful thing. I, this is my first time meeting you, first time hearing about it because I'm from Jersey. Okay. But I wanted to be here because I thought it was such a great thing that you're doing for the kids. Thank you. I was in the school system for 28 years, so I, I understand. I don't have any kids, but I understand kids. I love them. Yes, I love kids Especially too. Especially when they're not mine. Right, I hear that. <laughs> yes, that's right. So, I mean, here to try to show that I, I went somewhere with my life in um, many countries, traveled a lot, played basketball. I'm on my 13th season. And I just want to give back to my community, people that helped me. And um, any way I could be a positive influence, that's what I want to do. That's a wonderful thing. I think people, my mother always said, when you give an event, you can always tell the people that love you. That's right. Because they show up. That's right. So show it says up. a lot about you and your character. Yeah, that's what. Big thing about what my mom taught me was the morals, knowing right from wrong, and making the right decisions. And you got to live with whatever decision you make. So I just feel like it comes within me. That's a wonderful thing. Do you have anything else that you would like to say? No, I just want to say that yeah, everything that I have accomplished because of the support system I had and all the love that I've, I've had, I try to give back. And that's what That's it is. a wonderful thing. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'm proud of you. I appreciate you. Okay. Thank you. Okay. All right. Thanks. Have a good one.